To write the name for Mg3P2, we first need to recognize that this is an ionic compound. We have a metal bonded to a nonmetal. Metal and nonmetal, that's an ionic compound. And specifically, it's a binary ionic compound. That's because we have only two different elements, the magnesium and the phosphorus, bonded together here. So a binary ionic compound, we'll use these rules here. First, we name the metal, that's the magnesium, just as it appears on the periodic table. So Mg is magnesium, and then for the phosphorus, we name the nonmetal, that's the P, as it's on the periodic table, but we replace the ending with IDE. So all of this becomes IDE. So the name for Mg3P2 is magnesium phosphide. If we wanted to write the formula, we need to realize that magnesium, group two on the periodic table, when it bonds, it forms two plus ions. Each of these magnesiums here has an ionic charge of two plus. Phosphorus, that is three minus. So three minus times two plus, that's six minus, and then three times two plus, that's six plus. These cancel out. So the formula for magnesium phosphide is that Mg3P2. This is Dr. B with magnesium phosphide, Mg3P2. Thanks for watching.